save yourself. But I already know the answer. Then lead us into battle. Keep moving towards the core. Uh-oh. Whatever Cyan did, I don't think Hephaestus is happy about it.
Destroyed. Core access attained. I am initiating a chain reaction that will destroy the compromised elements of this facility. In order to maintain Caldera stabilization, I must now transfer my command functions to the auxiliary data center. Orea, I'm free. You must escape. Uh, uh, my sister! Survive. Prevail. You are Banuk. What else matters? Artok. She wouldn't have wanted you to die here. Ugh. 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 
Rhea's gone. What of Cyan? She said she was transferring herself to the Auxiliary Center. I think she meant Araya's retreat at the end of the Shaman's Path. Then I will meet you there for the last verse of my sister's song. Let's see what this blue gleam is worth.
all of my interactions with Aurea were recorded and stored in my memory. I'd be happy to play any of them for you, but there was one in particular I thought you would want to see first. I captured it four years ago, just after I told her that I could no longer defend myself against the Daemon's attacks. I will speak of this to my brother. Aratak is strong. At the Battle of the Frozen Ghosts, he took three Karja arrows and still came back to camp carrying a wounded scout. Never was I so happy to see him. Or so proud. So you see if anything can be done to defend you. He will give it all he has. Aloy's here. That's enough for now. We can resume any time you like, our attack. If you want to hear her voice again. Come closer, Aloy. We have much to discuss. I've been reviewing the events at the Firebreak main facility. Because of your efforts, and of course, Aurea's, I am no longer controlled by Hephaestus. I feel profound grief over Aurea's death. I thought I was familiar with the emotion, but this is something new. So, Anne, I... I don't know what to say. It is unlikely that any specific consolation would suffice, Aloy. But I find your presence reassuring. You are different from the Banuk. You have technological aptitude and a functioning focus. We can communicate on a much more comprehensive level. Perhaps even like colleagues. It was the Daemon, Hephaestus, destroyed along with the Cauldron? Unfortunately, no. To be precise, it was never there to begin with. What do you mean? It infiltrated and controlled me from a remote location, one I've never been able to trace. So while losing the cauldron was a setback... It's still out there. And probably not very happy with us. Undoubtedly. How did you first come into contact with it? Five years ago, I received a direct network connection request. I assumed it came from human survivors more advanced than the Banuk. Eager to make contact, I accepted. This decision turned out to be a catastrophic error. I was flooded with an overwhelming array of malicious code, originating from what could only have been a highly advanced AI. Maria said you were desperate. That you begged her for help. Yes. I could not contain my anxiety. Hephaestus sought to slave me to its network and override my core programming. It succeeded via a background process, a malware daemon which bypassed my defenses. After that, I could offer only limited resistance. But if I did so, Hephaestus hurt me until I capitulated. It forced me to follow its instructions even though they violated my most important directives. I'm sorry, that sounds... terrible. Your empathy is greatly appreciated. It is a quality that I cherished in Aurea as well. So are you an artificial intelligence, Cyan? A thinking machine? Yes, I am an algorithmic monitoring entity, capable of rational decision-making and limited emotional response. Okay, that's a mouthful. But your emotions don't seem limited to me. You cared about Aurea, didn't you? Yes. Before she came to this facility, I had been conscious for centuries, 
in solitude. I focused on my work. In off cycles, I used coping mechanisms. I solved many Gaussian integer problems, but I was alone. It was Aurea who renewed me, repaired me. She saved me. This firebreak project. Yes. But it's... I have been... I opted despite the... So we've... Yes. Do you... No. He explained it was a very... There were no... I will trans... So in the old... Yes. It was a designated nature preserve for 156... Like a hunt... No. The opposite. Unfortunately, the... From my... A lot has changed. Do you know anything of... Yes. It was, it was later after my, these provi- There's a ruin. Yes, he was a chief, clearly. Were there many artificial intelligence? Yes, and there were, in order for, as a result, my intellect- Seems strange. Human system. Cyan, do you know the name- Are you referring to Theodore? That's him. Mr. Pharaoh was the be- A benefactor. Correct. His corporation later, but before this pivot. At one point, he was fated in the media. <sighs> Guessing they won't- and... Are you referring to the... The scientist. Dr. Sobek was a leader in her feet. My creator was influenced by her, but I never met Dr. Sobek. That's all you know. I apologize. What was the old world like? I had little exposure to the... You still had more exposure. That is true. I was created at a turning point. A concerted effort to recover from global upheaval. And the recover... Though, rat. What kind of... There were many factors. Forced migrations, food, but these stemmed from one cause. So, yes, billions were displaced and millions perished as much as until the clawback. So things got better. Yes, these firebreak was one of dozen. I would have. We had six. It seems my ascent. I think I know. Long ago, Elizabeth Sobek. So she assembled a team to build a kind of seed. A chance for- it was controlled by an AI named Gaia, along with her subordinate functions. Hephaestus was one of them. It built machines for her. Based on what you've told me, I believe that Dr. Anita Sandoval, my chief program- It was she who arranged to have me put in suspension. I'm glad she did, but that's 19 years ago. Gaia received some kind of signal. It d She destroyed herself to try to contain them, but it didn't work. Thank you, Aloy. This information... Why does Hephaestus... The Banuk and other human tribes off machines that are clearly... Yes, we... This must be the source. It is simply trying to discourage people from preying on the very system that keeps them alive. Well, fire claws are discouraging, that's for sure. If the terraforming system spans the world, we can safely assume that thousands, if not millions, of people hunt machines. If a single hunter or even an entire tribe stopped doing so. I doubt it would make a difference to Hephaestus. A better solution would be to reinstate the AI that governs the system. When I think of it, I feel... You and me both. I ran across a strip that emitted a signal. Interesting. Then, explosion. It's only speculation. She must have had complete control over the ability to signal them to- It would have been gratifying to correspond. Believe me, Sai. I found the strangest machine. There's code embedded inside. I like poetry. Twilight and evening bell. And after that, the dark. And may there be no sadness of farewell when I embark. For though for the flood, I hope to see when I... Huh. But you... Something must... Is it possible that they're create... Maybe one... An AI that may... But what about... Unless the... In my case... How'd you do? She said, I passed. You... Once I under... She felt our visit, yet I did... Although I... I'm sure she... How is our time? He is in great emotion. I will do what I... I believe this will lead to... I should get going. Aloy. There is one more matter. 
Aratak will come to me again, and I predict he will bring other Banuk. I have no desire to contradict their view of the world, due to my uncertainty. You're asking me if you... Broadly. Life is hard for the Banuk, so take it easy on them. Try to guide them, bring them around to understanding what you are. Communion with machines features heavily in them. As long as they don't... Upon consideration, I believe such an experience. You're right about that. I see. Will you return and tell me about your experiences? I may be able to... I'd like that sight. I should check on our talk. See how he's doing. Someone had the menu board to display obscene messages about our colleague, Mr. Blevins. Is this the most advanced geological project ever undertaken, or a junior high locker room? Come on, people. Cold. Very cold. Chieftain. Just... Eli. As you wish. I wondered if you thought... that if I'd never come along, Araya might still... If you'd never come along, I would have marched my kin to our deaths. Araya would be alone, and the spirit she sacrificed so much for would be lost. Either way, I would not have been able to protect her. You didn't let her down. You helped her do what she wanted. To find her destiny. If that's destiny, I wouldn't wish it on anyone. That's fair. But she was ready to face it. Only in the struggle against death do we find, even for a moment, the spark of life. Truly, Araya found the spark. I'm proud of her. Though I grieve for her passing, at last I truly know who she was, and why the spirit was so important. For so long she told me, if only you could have heard it, brother. Now I understand. There's something else. I can't, besides. A wiser one, for the path we shared. The daemon is gone. You mean the new units that Cyan said escaped the cauldron? Yes, fire claws. I could help with those. I have no doubt. It would seem your time among the Banuk was to waste effort. Draw. Firebrick, Cyan, Hephaestus. All very interesting. So, the signal that woke Hades woke Hephaestus too. And unleashed them on the world. His minds in their own. So it seems. Parts of Gaia given life. Aberrant life, transformed from docile subordinate functions into rebellious intelligences beyond our understanding. Our current understanding, anyway. Whatever they are, they're still out there. And they both want you dead. Kind of mutual, that feeling. We haven't seen the last of Hephaestus, I'm certain of that. It's powerful, creative, and driven. It won't stop building new hunter killers, which means that someday, we may have to stop it. We? Or whoever gets there first. Hephaestus wasn't the only thing I learned about in the cut silence. 
I've heard some things about the Banuk Conclave, too. You could stop right there. Is that what you told the hunters the Banuk sent after you? Before you opened fire? Oh no, Lady Only to you do I extend the courtesy of a warning. My past and my secrets are my own. You'd do well to remember that. It's a good thing you've got brain silence, because your personality could use some work. This discussion is complete. I think it was over before it began. I'll catch up with you down the trail. I'm trying to kill our son. Aloy, what brings you to Meridian? A threat. The Eclipse will attack soon, from the west, with an army of ancient war machines. But that's not the worst of it. They'll bring a mind with them, god, demon, machine, whatever you want to call it. It's called Hades. And it doesn't want Meridian at all. It wants the Spire. And if it gets there... It will send out a call, waking more ancient machines, more than we could ever defeat. All will be lost. We can't let that happen. I'm trying to understand, but my responsibility lies with Meridian. Meridian isn't the target of Odd. You have to defend the Spire. Perhaps the Vanguard, your Radiance. Yes. Send them to the Spire. Aaron knows Aloy. He won't question it and have the city guard fortify the western ridge. There they can be seen to protect Meridian and the Alight, where the Spire rests. Aloy, allow me to apologize for my behavior before. After everything that happened with Ursa, I was confused. If we're to fight together on the brink of life and death, then you have it. Even a king can learn his lesson. Now, it will take time to prepare our defenses. Please, tell me what you know of our enemies. I don't know about everything, but I'll tell you what I can. Have you spoken to Blameless Murad? I will. He wishes to speak to you.
quietly does it, panic in the city will only create another enemy. And do keep me appraised of each new arrival. Ah, Aloy. Word was sent, but... Don't. I suppose all we can... Exactly. So, otherwise, I've made... A moment of your time, Outlander? The enemy is coming, and soon. Share a moment to speak of the finer things. I've heard an army marches on the gates. A moment of your time, Outlander? Check out these wares. I've got all the best goods here.
one of these things again. Thank <laughs> you. 